And so, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, I thank you for your word. Thank you for your angels that are assigned to each and every one here that are under the sound of my voice. Hello there, beautiful people. What's up? It's your girl, sherri For those of you who are tuning in, I welcome you to this channel. I welcome you to be a part of uh, this ministry. So guys, I'm here. I'm back. The Holy Spirit have sent me. He wants to speak to someone today. The Lord have brought revelation to me this week, and he wants me to come on here and to share it with you guys someone will be set free someone will be delivered someone will gain some type of knowledge hallelujah and so i know it's not for everyone some of you might know this and this word might not be for some of you but nevertheless the lord wants someone to know that you have angelic assistance assigned to you hallelujah you have angelic beings assigned to you so guys this is what happened on the 5th of january i know i came on here and i spoke and i said that i heard a voice saying that i am your personal assistant the lord had downloaded to me this week and he revealed to me this week that it was an angel that was speaking to me it was an outer voice that i heard um, it was not an inner voice. It was not the voice of the Holy Spirit. It was an angel that said to me, I am your personal assistant. I know I came on here and I said it was the Holy Spirit, but God revealed to me that it is not the Holy Spirit. It was not the Holy Spirit. It is an assigned angel assigned to my destiny. And so many of you, you are in the prophetic or you have some calling in ministry. There are angels that are assigned to your destiny. You have been called by God. You have been called for ministry. The enemy sees this and sometimes he wants to bring a destruction. He wants to stop the purpose and the plan of God. But these angelic beings that are assigned to your destiny is to help you accomplish the purpose of God, is to help you to accomplish the things of God in the earth. Many of you know when God have called you into a ministry or called you into the prophetic or whatever it may be, um, the enemy knows this and he tries to uh, steal, to kill, and to destroy. This is the um, enemy's mission. And so he and his minions, he and his demons come to cause destruction. But how many of you know that God also have his angelic being he has multiple of angels and there are specific angels that are assigned to you and so the lord began to speak to me this week and he began to share with me every time i speak and i speak the word of god it activate every angelic assistant assigned to me or assigned to my destiny to um carry out the mandate of god here in the earth and so God wants us today to know that we have that assistant and he wants us to use, to use the tools, to use your weapon. Your weapon is the word of God. And um, he is saying today, allow the angels to work on your behalf. We don't want to have the angels sitting with their arms crossed with nothing to do. Every time you use the word of God, every time you begin to worship and praise the Father, it activates every angel that is assigned to your destiny in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord further began to give me revelation about the time where I was in the lowest time of my life and I had this outer body experience and I went up and I saw this um, being in the mirror. It was a little girl. And she was praising and she was worshiping. And then after this, the Lord also took me back up. And then I saw myself doing this. And so these angels are assigned to carry out certain mandates. Um, 
And so the Lord began to reveal to me that certain people in the Bible, in the word of God, such as Daniel was visited by an angel. He was in the most distressed time and an angel visited him. Also, he brought the attention to Peter when he was in captivity. An angel um, was released to him. John, when he was in prison, an angel visited him. Hallelujah. When God sought out to destroy and corrupt the city of Sodom and Gomorrah, there were two angels that were sent to warn Lot. Mary, she was sent an angel, hallelujah. And so many times angels will come to assist you or to allow you to know the plans and purpose of God um, for your life. And so guys, I have been experiencing so many times I'm in a dream. Um, I have to make a phone call. I don't know the number. And all of a sudden, a little girl would appear and she would give me the number to call. Or I'm walking, I'm going somewhere in the dream. And all of a sudden, um, a little girl appears and she would give me a specific direction or a male or female would show me the way that I need to go. Hallelujah. And so when this happens in the realm of the spirit, it also manifests in the natural. And so God wants to tell many of you that you have angelic assistance and he wants you to use what he have given to you. Hallelujah. And so the Lord took me to Psalm 91, 11, and it says, for he shall give his angels charge over you to keep you in all your ways in their hands they shall bear you up hallelujah your angels are there to assist you to help you to help you get to the next level to help you go to the next dimension to help you to move from one place to the other your angels are assigned to you and every time you pray and ask god for help every time you use the word of god it activates your angels and they are dispatched to help you they are dispatched to assist you in the name of Jesus. So God is saying to us today, use the tools of God, use the things of God that he has set for you in this time to help you to accomplish every purpose, every plan that he has for you, um, even before the foundation of the earth earth children of God so that is the word I don't know who the Lord is speaking to today but he is speaking to many of you and he's saying that you have assistance use it child of God do not allow the angels to be without work allow them to work on your behalf and to change the situation change the things in your life that needs to be changed in the mighty name of Jesus so guys I thank you all for tuning in I love you guys so much stay blessed stay tuned and until my next one. Bye.